Hello, Louisiana Beer Reviews. This is a, tru a trio review, not a duo, a trio review of Schaefer. Schaefer, America's oldest lager beer since 1842. That's how long this has been on the market. Okay, so this is probably just a regular beer, meaning it's probably going to have that old style. Oh, yeah. You can't even find out the ABV. So it was established like in 1842 before the Civil War. Uh, stored in cold place. It says it's made with the finest quality ingredients. Uh, Apple Beer brewed in the U.S. Made in the U.S. of A. Milwaukee, Wisconsin. So you notice it's going to be like the Milwaukee beers. So but it originally say. started in New York City. But the company... New York City! Yeah, Schaefer, Maximilian Schaefer got bought out in 1981. And so then the operations got moved. But it had been a brewery in New York City for a long time. Glass. I haven't split three beers. Yeah, I've never done that one. I like this glass with the little jewel little glasses or snifters. Yeah. Little snifter glasses. Uh, we used to get Schaefer back in the 1990s, and you could get a 24-pack for $7.98. It was called the Weekender. And I would buy it, and I used to like it. And then it just disappeared, and we can still get Schaefer light at a few stores. Uh -huh. Why we get the light, I don't know. But um, anyway, it's sort of rare. And I want to thank Brian Lane from New York, the state of New York, the, where Schaefer started. Thank you, Brian. Thank you, for Brian. For sending this. Thank you, yeah. I love the classic label design, too. They're going yeah. to change it. It'll, it's got that bar. Red and gold. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. So the appearance of it is, is golden. I'm getting a lot of bubble action, almost like what you. It it you know what it looks like? It looks like Miller High Life. It it's looks just like Miller High Life. Sort of in that vein, you know. Yeah. So oh, you know what it smells like? Beer. Yeah. Good like going on I'm, I'm, beer I'm gonna I'm gonna leave it at that. Like going on a if picnic. you know what beer smelled like before beer went all over the place. This is base beer. Right. So, it's got that graininess. You can yeah. smell the barley and the barley. I'm not really smelling any corn on it. I'm not smelling any corn. It's just very clean smelling. Very. Yeah. I mean, there's not really too much to it. Um, but then again, what do you expect with yeast. a beer like this? Get a little yeast. Should have rinsed the glass out a little better. I'm getting a little whiskey. I know that's not made of Oh, haha. Smells good though. It's got a little hop action, um, little, but like Schaefer always said, it's a round beer. You're not supposed to be able to pick out stuff. It's just like a, like you said, a beer tasting beer that you it's guzzle a beer. back. Beer, yeah. It's it's a well balanced, well put together. I guess it, it's true what it says. The finest ingredients. It's it's just a good beer. And like they always said in their old ads, it's not the first one you drink, it's the second and third that you drink that makes you really enjoy it. Because it's made for multiple Why is it that all, my, all of my favorite American or, uh, you know, adjunct loggers, I can't get them. <laughs> yeah, it's strange. Red yeah. Dog, this. Um, of course, yeah, extra maybe, gold. Maybe, maybe well, yeah, I've never tried that, but I'm sure I've loved it too. Here that you can't get in Georgia. Schlitz. PBR. We were David and I were talking last night. Uh, PBR Extra. Love it. Uh, I bought the last 12 pack on the shelf, and I can't. It's gone. It lasted. He a did week. too. It lasted a week in in Georgia. But thanks, for, Paps, for that for that tease. What would you score this? I give it an A. I, mean, I give it an A. I give it a 97 out of 100. 97. Yep. Wow. And you, got a, you got a can that you can bring home and do a really After cool walking thing. outside in this, you know, humidity, humidity. and yeah, it, it, nothing's better than this right now. Yep. This would go great with a ham sandwich with Swiss cheese and some ice Long cream. Ass on it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. On the white bread. The white bunny bread. <laughs> it's almost got like a little bit of that wine quality that you talk about with um, Paps. Your Paps. Right. Yeah. A little bit of that. A little twang, a little twang, or you know what I mean, like a little. Man, I can remember back in 1998 being at the uh, Endymion Parade over there by Orleans Avenue and drinking this, and a guy telling me, I said, "You drink Schaefer?" He's like, "I love this beer. This is a great beer." And it was 12, 3.99 a 12 pack, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. 
So you'd recommend it? Oh yeah, definitely. Too bad we can't get it here. Yeah, except for the light, which we'll have to address one day. So Les Ailes Les Bon Temps Relais, a great classic beer, which, hey Paps, how about you let us actually be able to buy it? Right. I'm going to end this review What's by saying... What's going on, Paps? Hmm. Ain't nobody can figure them out. We're going to end this review by saying, y'all come on down to Jefferson Parish, Louisiana. <laughs>